Hey guys, you're watching Super Nelly. My name is AJ, and welcome back to another episode of Zonocraft Season 2, Episode 143, I think. Today we're going to have a bit of a serious talk. I'm just getting some stuff ready uh, for this episode. Grabbing some wood. We're going to be going out on uh, an adventure today. Uh, but, hmm, how am I going to word this, right? This world was created pretty much when the last big update came out like the the last huge uh, update that we had and we've been surviving off very well uh with the update that we've currently got now an update came out pretty recently what have i got i've got dirt in there i need some wood for this episode uh, we've been surviving very very well on just uh sort of chilling uh, on this update, doing everything that I can think of here. We've got farms, we've got iron things, we've got villages, we've got all sorts. Uh, but, in all fairness here, and I know this isn't going to sit well with a lot of you, there's not much more that I can do with the current update that we have. Now, you might see where this is going. <laughs> uh, there's just not much. We, we, we've done absolutely everything. There's a few projects on the world unfinished and I am unfortunately starting a new project today but there isn't it's not all bad news okay I'm trying to break this to you as easy as, we, as I possibly can I'm going to take some carrots with me as well because we might be gone for a while whoops not a hoe because we might be gone for a little while I'm, I'm not sure yet is there anything else that I might want with me ah new armor you know what that's not going to break anytime soon. That isn't going to break s that soon, I can't see. If that breaks, I'm not bothered about it. I don't care about blast protection. And my uh, my pants, my leggings, whatever, are already <laughs> gone. So I'll repair them at a later date. But basically, what I'm trying to say is, is Zonocraft Season 2 will be taking uh, a break. What way do we want to go here? Should I take a map? I probably shouldn't. Basically, right, what I want to do is I want to go out and I want to find a nice ocean biome and I want to build a big boat as like uh, a beta base, you know, base number B. Uh, number B? <laughs> base letter B. Uh, just because I want to, I haven't built a boat on this world yet and that is something that I do want to do. I'm going to go this way, I think, out past the desert village, past the swamp. I think there's a swamp this way. But yeah, Zonocraft Season 2 is going to be taking a, a break only until the next update comes out, though. It's not going to be a forever thing. It's not like uh, how the um, uh, Let's Build a City series has gone where it's just not returning, uh, at least not for a very, very long time. Uh, this will return as soon as we get another update that dramatically changes uh, the game and giving me a load of ideas. I've got literally probably around 40 or 50 ideas to do on this world, but they can't be done until we get the new stuff. We need the new biomes. We need the new some new crafting things. We need some new blocks. We need we need some new stuff. I haven't I haven't got anything really to do here without having some new material. So when we take a break from Zonocraft, we need something to replace it. The City Skylines series, I can see a smile coming back on your face already when I say that. The City Skylines series uh, ended pretty recently, only uh, a couple of weeks ago or a week ago or something like that. And uh, I was actually really surprised about the disappointment uh, that a lot of you had uh, about us ending that. I thought uh, that we sort of done everything and you guys uh, were, were happy about moving on. Turns out you weren't. Turns out that... 99% of you were actually really disappointed in that series. And the funny thing is, is that series started to pick up in views uh, the longer on it went. There's a creeper explosion or something there. <laughs> Weird. Uh, the longer on it went, the uh, the more uh, views I actually ended up getting. So, while Zonocraft is away, while we're waiting for TU27 or 28 or whenever the next big feature, biome feature update even if it just had red sand and i don't know the uh there are some blocks in the game aren't there that aren't actually in the update i know a lot of people found them in the codes on the 360 version because you can get into the files on 360 version using a, a computer you can't do it with xbox one yet there's another creeper hole uh but they found a uh, red sand they found the uh prism no pre premise i can't say the exact word uh but there's like a, an underwater temple uh, that can be found in oceans and stuff like that. I think I found all of this stuff. Yeah. 
Um, we've been to that village, by the way, guys. Don't worry about that. I'm not missing anything. I'm just trying to find an ocean here. I'm just keep wandering. We're having fun. Um, so yeah, they're, they're actually in the game, but they can't actually be... They're not accessible as such. So maybe in the next update, they'll be bringing those out. If Red Sand is in the update, uh, or if Red Sand is in the game files, that pretty much uh, suggests, to me at least, that the new biomes are on their way, because obviously Red Sand is found in Mesa biomes. We've already got the stained clay that we can get in both creative whoops and survival. So, seeing as though we can get both of them in, in, in both game modes, uh, it's only red clay left in that biome that we need to have in order to be able to have the uh, biome spawn. Uh, but yeah, if they come out, if it comes out soon, then Zonocraft will be back very, very quickly. Zonocraft won't stop entirely because we do have some other stuff to do. Like, I'm build I'm going to start a bow today, hopefully, if we find an ocean biome. And, uh... uh we, we need to finish that off. So the Zono episodes, the Zonocraft episodes won't stop. Don't worry about that. They won't stop entirely. They'll just be reduced until uh, the next update comes out. So let's get back to the City Skylines, the series that is going to be replacing it. In uh, the season, the series season that just ended of City Skylines, we were playing the game uh, in the sort of, uh, how would you say, it? in like a career mode. I'm going to call it in like a career mode style. Where we don't, where we have to build up our money in order to buy things, uh, in order to grow our city, etc., etc. We were doing stuff in a very, uh, in the most sort of space efficient way. We were packing in buildings, packing in everything as close to each other as we possibly could, so that, oops, ow, so that we could actually, um, uh, you know, get as much out of the space that we have uh, to the best of our our ability. But I want to try it a different way. I, in fact, want to try it the way that most people play that game. The most people that play that game actually use the uh, unlimited money um, mod that's actually built into the game. It's not a mod that you download. It's a mod that's built in. Aha! Is this an ocean or is this the end of the world? I've got a feeling this is the end of the world. Let's swim out and see if we can see. If this is the end of the world, it's not going to be any good for us. Yeah, it's the end of the world. You can always tell... Because of the giant chasm. <laughs> that comes from... Okay, so this is no good. We'll have to go back another way. So a lot of people play it with unlimited money, with everything unlocked, and build an aesthetically pleasing uh, build, uh, uh, city. Now, if you don't know what that means, aesthetically pleasing means uh, it looks really nice. Okay, so we're going to make a city that actually works. We're going to have people living in it, and we're going to be playing it like on... On play mode, we're going to need power, we're going to need water, we're going to need uh, schools and fire stations and police stations and uh, public transport and all of that stuff. But we're not going to worry too much or, or at all, in fact, about space. We're going to make sure our village, our city, looks superb. The better it looks, uh, the, the better I'm going to feel about it. And that's actually how a lot of you were suggesting to me on how to play it uh, during the uh, first season. So hopefully a lot of you guys will be happy about that. I know there's going to be a lot of people that are going to be disappointed. That Zonocraft uh, is going to be slowing down in episodes. But I repeat again. And please let anybody know in the comment section below. That hasn't made it this far into the video. Uh, whoops. Before uh, complaining in the comment section. Zonocraft is not ending. It's not finishing. There will still be episodes coming out. They'll just be a little bit more sparse than they currently are. Currently, we do this series, uh, like most of the Minecraft series, most series on the channel, in fact, aha, every three days. Uh, but uh, we might do maybe one episode a week, similar to how Alien Craft goes. One episode a week is only basically half, <laughs> half of what it was before. Uh, every three days, once every week, you know. That's basically two episodes a week as it would be before. So we're only halving the amount. Uh, it might even drop a little bit less than that. I don't know. It all depends on if we can find some stuff to do. You know, after we complete all the projects. With the current update that we've got and the current resources that we've got available to us. We don't have much more to us. Now, I'm not having a stab at the game. I'm not having a stab at anybody. I think, well, I'm not a huge fan of... Ocean... Of... of um what's it called swamp biome 
I would like to find just a natural ocean biome. Let's check out over there. I'd like to find a natural ocean biome, really. Ooh, loads of mobs. Uh, so, yeah, let me know in the comment section below your thoughts and feelings. I'm always interested to sort of see, hear what you have to say about it. I think a lot of you will probably agree with me. A lot of you will hopefully be glad that uh, the City Skyline series uh, should be coming back uh, for Season 2 in a much different way to what it was before. Uh, I'm going to keep looking. I'm going to keep exploring. I want to find something, some, a place that's really, really nice that I feel really, really happy with. And while we're looking, we can just uh, continue chatting. Uh, so yeah, obviously at the moment we do have the uh, Polybridge series going. I love that game. If you guys haven't, if you guys have avoided uh, watching those episodes on the channel, uh, I don't know why you sh you have been because it's a fantastic game. Uh, any new game that I do on my channel, I only play if I if I am going to enjoy it. And if I enjoy it, you guys have a much better chance of enjoying it uh, because obviously that's how things work. If you if you see someone enjoying something, you're more likely to enjoy it. And uh, if you haven't looked at it because you just don't want to sort of l try a new game, I recommend watching episode one first, obviously, and then watch episode two. Just watch two episodes of it. If after two episodes you're really not enjoying it, then no problem. Check this out. <laughs> That's some weird water, isn't it? That's the edge of the world, though, as well. I, I want to find just an ocean biome. That would be just great for us. I really don't want to build at the edge of a swamp. If I do have to, I will, but I'd rather not. Okay, so anything else that I, more that I need to say about uh, this series? You know, about Zonocraft, it's not stopping. It's just sort of uh, dropping down in episodes until we get the new biomes or new update or new uh, recipes or something that we can actually make some episodes out of. Whoops. I didn't want to fall down here. Uh, City Skylines is coming back. I recommend watching the Polybridge series. Uh, City Skylines, I'm really, really excited about that. Uh, I will be watching a few other YouTubers uh, that play City Skylines in that way. Because I haven't played that game in that exact way before. I've played other games like that. You know, I've played Sit um, uh, Sim City in a very similar way to that. Uh, I also actually built uh, my hometown on City Skylines off camera. That was pretty fun to do. Uh, but I'm really excited about making really cool highway intersections and uh, making it nice and compact in areas and nice and big in others. Aha! This looks like a nice area. Yeah, it's not a swamp. That's a swamp over there, but it's not here. Okay. Uh, so I'm excited about that. Um... Hmm, but yeah, all the other Minecraft series obviously all are still going to continue. Uh, we've got loads and loads and loads of other series. We've got the Theme Park series. We've got uh, the Simpsons series on PC. Uh, we've got the uh, Nether Castle series that's going on. Once the Nether Castle series, that instantly gets replaced uh, by another uh, Minecraft sort of Let's Build Creative series. So there's still plenty, plenty to do. I'm actually thinking that this is like the perfect spot. I'll tell you why. I don't like the swamp over there. But this side is actually forest, okay? Which means we're going to have really nice uh, uh, leaves. You can see where the water changes. You can see where the biome changes there. Oh, hiccups. This is a really nice peninsula sort of thing. We could build the boat over there because that's a really nice looking place. And it also opens straight up to what is actually the edge of the world but looks like a giant ocean. Oh, wow. Did you hear that whistle in my voice then? I don't know if the mic picked that up or not. That nearly deafened me. <laughs> um, yeah, that goes to the uh, to the ocean there. In fact, there is quite a way to go. Look, if you look over there. Oh, it's like a little. Is that an island? Oh, it is an island. Is it? It looks like it's an island. Oh, this is a beautiful little area though. Yeah, that's the edge of the world. That's the edge of the world. But here is more than big enough to build in. In fact, it goes it goes quite a way. I don't know if that line there, can you see that? I don't know if that line is actually the end of the world. No. Oh, no, look, there's islands over there. This is an ocean biome. Oh, sweet. Okay, let's keep looking then. Let's keep looking over there. Uh, see if we can find an even better space. I really like that space. Don't forget 
what way that is. It's a little bit close to a swamp, but um, I am happy to build there if needs must. What have we got over here, though? We've got a couple of little islands. Oh, this is actually a really cool spot as well. Like, we could make a little dock here with a nice big boat. That's got to be the edge of the world, right? I'm, I'm sure that this is the edge of the world here. Yeah, there's the edge of the world right there. Wonderful. Okay, so if we're going to build, we're going to have to build that side. I am half tempted to see what's... What's over here? Mind you, I don't want to load up too much. Uh, I don't want to generate too much ungenerated land uh, for when we do get Mesa biomes. I think I've still got a load of land undiscovered. Uh, if not, we'll have to sort of rethink, maybe start a season three. I don't want to. I'll, I'll do my best not to start a season three. But hopefully there's Mesa biomes and stuff out that way once we get them. I really like this area. I really like this island. I'm building a boat right in this uh, middle part here. That would be really cool. Okay, so let's get a, a basic base of operations set up here. Uh, I need to get a bed. I did see some sheep back over that way. Yep. So we'll grab the uh, the wool from them. I didn't bring any resources over. I don't know if that was a terribly bad idea or not. I only bought wood because obviously we're going to be, be building the majority of our of our boat out of wood. Like, uh, like most boats are. Uh, hopefully I can get three wool out of these if I get one from each one. Uh, as far as stone goes, I think we will actually be using a, a little bit of stone. Uh, these one-shot, these they do. This sword one-shot sheep. That's pretty cool. Um, uh, we, we can set up like a little mining operation here uh, in order to get iron and stone and, and cobblestone and everything else that we're going to need here. And obviously diamonds if we need to set up our own uh armors and stuff like that over here and for anything else that we want on the boat as far as villagers go obviously i do like to have villagers on anything i build if there's a village nearby i'm sure we can cart them over here somehow it might be a little bit of a struggle but it will be fun to do and uh we should just have to see how it goes so let's use this wood here make a little crafting table we know this this is like starting a new world isn't it so let's uh, uh put you down no that's not <laughs> <laughs> that's not the, what we wanted and then we'll make a double chest I think so we'll go uh, 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 uh. make a couple of chests stick that down there and I can bung all this stuff away and we're gonna be somewhat safe at least we should be I don't know how I got cactus and dirt on me oh yeah that must be when I dug out of the place mustn't it I remember now Put that in there, that in there, that in there, that in there. We just need a little bit of wood here in order to make a bed out of. Doop, doop, doop. Ooh, oops. Uh, uh, uh. That recipe never made sense to me. <laughs> it should be the other way. It should be two wool and four wood. That would make more sense, uh, in my opinion. But, okay, whatever. Uh, let's just put a bed. I should really have this underground or something. Yeah, we'll be fine. I'll put that up there. Perfect. All right, guys. Uh, I am going to leave the episode there. I know it's a shorter episode. It's not too much shorter than it would be otherwise. Uh, but it was sort of just a, a fill episode uh, so you can understand exactly what's going on. Why Zono Craft recently has been a little bit less uh, busy over the last couple of episodes. It's because I've been trying to think of things to do. <laughs> It, to be totally honest with you. Obviously, feel free to write down in the comment section below if you have any ideas on, on stuff that we can do on this world. Uh, but I think you guys uh, will enjoy the new uh, City Skyline series uh, that will be starting to soon. And please remember, Zonocraft is not ending. It's not finished. It will be carrying on. There will just be less episodes until we get an update out. I hope you guys understand. Uh, I hope you, you agree with me, most likely. Most of you agree with me on stuff I say, uh, which makes me feel <laughs> a lot better. It means that I'm not the only one that thinks in the same way sometimes. Uh, but yeah, uh, until then, we shall see you guys in the next episode. If you enjoyed it, hit that like button. If you haven't already, please subscribe.